Hi everybody, it's Valerie from Valerie's Cuddly Cat Crochet and Sewing, and my co-host Molly is with me. And I am sorry for the lighting. Let me say that it is not your. Do not adjust your TV set, <laughs> or whatever they used to say. Um, yeah, it's it's um, Saturday, March. No, yes, it is March. Oh my gosh, Saturday, March fifth, twenty twenty two, and it's like seven something in the morning. And it's a rainy day outside, so the lighting outside is not usual. So I turn on my light up ahead, and it's like, looks really fuzzy. Anyway, this is going to be a short video anyway. <clears throat> I'm still sick, but I'm getting better. I appreciate everybody's prayers and thoughts. Um, this is like the first morning that I woke up and I could actually, like, breathe, <laughs> which is always a nice thing. Um, I still don't have too much of a voice, but I have a little bit of a voice. So I'm going to use it on this, and then it's probably going to be gone. <laughs> anyway, it is, as promised, Seaside Saturday. I've even got my little sand pail, sand bucket, and shovel or spade. Um, oh, and <laughs> what I'm looking for is inside the bucket. Yeah, my brain is still not quite <laughs> back to normal. <laughs> Whatever normal is for me. All right, so um, this is actually Seaside video number three, um, but there's, I, I don't want to confuse you. Um, this was the applique from Seaside video number two. It is still not finished, so I'm going to put that aside for a second <laughs> and show you my first official finished applique for my Seaside video. Uh, wall hanging it's not going to be a blanket it's going to be a wall hanging so um and this is it again i'm so sorry for the looks like i'm in a fishbowl a dirty fishbowl or something <laughs> uh, anyway um here is my it's a sea star starfish whatever you want to call it um i left a nice long tail for sewing it on later and miss molly is trying to eat my nice long tail so that is the first official one i did not put a face on it i I'm planning to put faces, like little happy smiles, you know, on some of, some of the things that I do, but not everything. I mean, I personally would put them on everything, but I, I mean, maybe I will. I don't know. So th as far as I know, this is finished. I'm just going to put it like this. All right, now to the shark. Okay, so when I pulled everything out for this project again, and I pulled out the shark applique, I'm like, that shark is huge. It's, it's so big. So, I started to work on another one with a smaller hook, and actually it didn't turn out to be much smaller, and it wasn't working out. I don't know what I was doing. So, this is like, I don't know how many times I've done this shark, and it's still not finished. <laughs> but, um, I honestly think there's something not quite right with the pattern, because, you know, let's just blame the pattern. <laughs> Might as well. Can't be me, right? <laughs> Um, so anyway, I'm going to leave, this is, this is it. I, I'm just, I'm, I wasn't going to use this one because it was too big, but the other ones I was making didn't work out. So I'm going back to this one and it's not done yet. So this is going to be what I'm going to work on, um, for my next finished applique. So sometime between now and next Saturday, I'm going to, um, stitch the gills on, put the eye on, stitch the mouth mouth on and um, get rid of my ends here. I did not leave it a long tail for sewing so I may have to like tuck some yarn away with this one because I don't know when I'm going to be sewing these on in the future and I want to make sure I have that yarn. Um, yeah. Anyway, so this is like in progress and for next week. <laughs> it's going in my bucket. <laughs> All right, that is a quick video, but I can already tell my voice is not going to last too much longer. Um, just a quick chit-chat thing. Uh, today I am hoping to work on my green dinosaur and my blue dinosaur, so I'll have it as a finished object for next week, or finished objects. Um, I'm saving the hedgehogs as kind of an at-work project, and since I haven't been at work all week, um, hopefully next week I will get going on the hedgehogs. I got some of my yarn in, 
and I don't have it within arm's reach. No, I do. Hold on. I'm going to show you the yarn that I got for some of the hedgehogs. All right. I am in love with these yarns. So I don't, I didn't have any go for faux yarn, um, but that's what is called for in the pattern. And so I went crazy. Um, and again, my camera light, it, the, the lighting is not right, but um, hot pink. <laughs> Can you imagine a hedgehog with hot pink fur? And this is, um, I don't, oh, this is called Glow Worm. And it is very bright, much brighter than is showing on the screen. Uh, much, much brighter. And then I got this one that is called Violet Starling. And it's, a uh, that one's showing pretty true to color. It's purple, purple and whatever. So I've gone crazy with buying this yarn. I've got more coming. <laughs> I've got enough to make a million hedgehogs because that's what I do. Um, <coughs> I also have bought, I've ordered some eyelash yarn and I'm going to try and pair that with like a, a variegated worsted weight and see if that, what that does. So anyway, I'm having fun with the hedgehogs and hopefully I have more of an update on those. Um... Today I will be finishing my uh, rectangle granny granny blanket. <laughs> I keep wanting to call it a rectangle granny square. It can't be a square and a rectangle. Well, I guess it can, but anyway. <laughs> I'm going to finish that because I've got like two rounds left to go when I'm done. Um, one of the cats, uh, I, I put a picture up on my Facebook group, but uh, Molly was taking a nap on it while I was trying to work on it yesterday. It is cat approved. Um, I think that's what I had planned for today. And then tomorrow I am going to start the spring fling. I'm excited and I'm nervous and I, uh, I hope I have not bit off more than I can chew, but, um, I have some good help from, uh, Jenny. So she's going to help me. So, yay. All right, everybody. My voice is like going and I am feeling better. I just don't sound better. I'm still tired and everything, but I'm anticipating going back to work on Monday. So that gives me two more days to rest up. All right. I will talk to you again Wednesday for Winging It Wednesday. Bye.